What's up, everybody? Welcome to the show. This right here is a short M4 guide. I'm going to be giving you two of my favorite M4 builds. I'm about mid-level right now, kind of midway through the game, 80 missions complete, somewhere in there, level 20. And I don't have the MK18 yet. I don't have the M700 unlocked yet, any of that. So I'm going to be giving you two builds. One's kind of more of my favorite, the marksman type style of play with the M4. Um, shooting M855, usually when I'm trying to go to tier two zones, tier three zones, uh, hollow point tracer when I'm at uh, tier one zones. This is going to be the first build. You're going to have the Spectre, which is one of the scopes you can buy from Gunny. I believe it's level two, maybe level one. I can't remember. And then this is the build right here. So you're going to be running the RK1 vertical grip that you unlocked out at Artisan. You're going to be running the nylon stock. You're going to need an M block for your uh, vertical grip. So you need to get that. You're going to need the SOCOM three prong flash hider so you can attach your RC1 suppressor. The pistol grip is going to be the mod pistol grip. All right. We're not really worried about weapon handling too much, you know, and, and we want good arm stamina drain. This is pretty good right here and decent recoil control. So that's why we have this. We're going to be going with a 16 inch barrel on actually both of these builds. And then uh, I leave the charging handle and everything else pretty much the same. Very comfortable, very easy. You can go full auto with it pretty consistently. But again, that's not what it's for. It's more for uh, being the fourth man, third man on the in the line and uh, doing those mid range fights, holding those angles and, you know, tapping heads. So so primarily with these builds, what I like to do marksman type of stuff is to try to get the arm stamina drain decent while still having a good kit. That's basically what I go for. And I've had a lot of success with it. I've lost like one PVP fight so far. So it's very fun. And this is probably one of my favorite builds because it's the type of play style I have. Now, that being said, the other one I have here is going to be another M4. Like I said, we're doing two M4 builds. You're going to have the uh, T2. That's the micro dot. You're going to need a mount for that. I'm going to pull it up here. We're going to have the same stock. You're going to need that Holoson high sight mount. Again, same stock, 16 inch barrel. We're going to go with the angled grip on this one because it gives us very good handling and recoil control. It does have a negative 14 arm stamina drain, which we're fine with. We're not really going to be holding ADS a lot right here. This is really for close quarters, mid-range fights. So we're happy with it. Now with this, this gun, when you buy it from Gunny, it comes with a M lock. You need to take that off and then just slap on the, uh, the grip that you buy from him, which is, again, the angled foregrip. We're going to go with the uh, mod pistol grip again, and then everything else we're going to leave the same. Same suppressor, SOCOM 3 mount, with the uh, suppressor on it. This gun, again, we want recoil control, weapon handling, gonna be an auto a lot of times. This is a pretty solid build for the front man. You wanna be able to snap on him and the gun doesn't really move, okay? Now you can still reach out there if you need to, especially with AI, that's why we don't do the iron sights or anything. You can kind of still reach out there and tap heads if you need to, if you're running solo or something. But again, it's primarily for that front man, solid recoil, automatic fire. So those are my two builds, guys. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments. Hey, also, we have a ton of good guys so far coming into the collective. We're trying to get everything lined up, man. There are so many people trying to help each other work together. We're trying to push people through some missions. we got our VIP program, solid group of guys. So I'm going to leave the link for that in the description below. Make sure you join up and check out my Twitch. I might be live now. I might not. But either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something. If you did, you know what to do. And I will catch you on the next one. Thank you.